time is 6.35 a.m. The news headline. Ohanese leader dumps 2023 presidency, demand state police devolution of power. The president general of Ohanese Indigbo Worldwide, Professor George Ubiozo, had in a welcome address during the one-day visit of President Muhammad Buhari to Uwiri. Imo State on Thursday demanded for state police to complement the federal police in insecurity management in Nigeria. The Igbo leader also renewed demand for devolution of powers between the federal and state governments. The President General of Oan is the Indigo Worldwide, Professor George Obiozo, was however silent on the zoning of presidency to the southeast in 2023. Governor Dave Umayi of Ebony State had defected from the People's Democratic Party PDP to the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC, complaining that in all the years, the Southeast supported the PDP massively, and the party did not consider it necessary to zone the presidential ticket to Southeast. The Ebony governor had repeatedly insisted that the APC and PDP should zone the presidential ticket to Southeast in 2023. The governor, some fortnight ago, expressed that it will feel very bad if the APC does not zone the presidential ticket to the, a to the Southeast in 2023. Meanwhile, the ruling party, APC, has zoned the uh, 2023 uh, ticket to the South, being contested by presidential aspirants from South, South, Southwest and Southeast, though at the lobbying stage. Professor Obiozo had, however, told the President Buhari that the most urgent and imperative need of Indigo today is insecurity. According to him, regrettably, our southeast zone has recently become a theater of conflict, negating the peace-loving nature of our people. The Wanese President, Professor George Obiozo, uh, who happens to be the President General of Wanese Indigo worldwide, as however said that uh, the Indigo needs security, therefore demanding that in this context, one is the Indigo calls for the establishment of a zonal and state police apparatus to support and complement the existing federal security architecture. He said that there is nothing more important to the Igbos in Nigeria today than the restoration of a serious sense of belonging and um, the spirit of Nigeria's founding father based on one nation, one destiny, seeing that it is possible through the devolution of power, ensuring a sense of balance in our political system. Under tight security, he visited Imo State, which is seen as the hub of operation of the Pro Biafra group Hypop in Nigeria's southeast. And the agitation for the independent Republic of Biafra uh, has led to killings and destructions in the southeast. And uh, Mr. Buhari, uh, you know, who was in Imo State for a one-day working visit to the state, he commissioned projects executed by Governor Hope Uzodema's administration and spoke on the importance of security as well as infrastructure on lives of the people. He says that if there are no roads, if there is no security, that what can people do? And um, he answered himself that definitely nothing. That uh, Mr. Buhari said this in his brief address in the state, in the state's capital. And therefore, the Uwanese, uh, Indigo, had actually begged uh, for favors, uh, you know, for, from the president, President Muhammad Buhari, saying that, you know, after they had deliberated on improving infrastructure and then the stemming insecurity across the Southeast, you know, the, uh, one is in the book, assured President Muhammad Buhari that they are with Nigeria as long as there is justice and um, you know the they are not marginalized. He said that the indigenous people of Biafra and other pro Biafra group have been fighting with the federal uh, and uh, and state governments to break away from Nigeria, but they are not uh, part of them and they are not uh, separated. Uh, according to Professor George Ubiozo, who is the president to Ohanizi, 
he said that Igbo would continue to be part of the of Nigeria as long as um, there is justice in the country. However, he also said that uh, in his word, Your Excellency, the security of Indigo in Nigeria and beyond has become a compelling priority, uh, a compelling primary responsibility of serious concerns for Indigo, saying that regrettably, our southeast zone has recently become a theater of conflict, negating the peace-loving nature of our people. And in this context, Owani Zendibu was calling for the establishment of a zonal and state police apparatus to support and complement the existing federal security uh, architecture. He made it known to President Muhammadu Buhari that he should see to the release of some youth that have been arrested in the name of indigenous people uh, of Biafra, that is IPOC. He said that a whole lot of them have either been mistakenly you know, uh, arrested by the police or military people, uh, uh, seeing them as um, uh, as bandits or as people that are causing issues in the country. And he says that uh, the the president needs to see to their release because they have been most of them have been arrested in hundreds, and um, while some of them have lost their lives. There are some people that are still languishing in pain in the police custody and even in prison, telling Mr. Buhari that he should please sit to their release as soon as possible. And the president, you know, being praised by Governor Uzodima for his administration efforts to develop the state, the president who commissioned a polytechnic uh, road project, a flood control tunnel, and a, a new executive chamber. The president said that uh, seeing is believing, and that with all that he has seen in the states, uh, that it justifies that uh, the uh, the invitation that Governor Opuzodema gave to him to come and see uh, that it actually uh, satisfies his integrity, and that he is very impressed with what he has done because he has gone through the same problem at the center to make sure that infrastructure is what would enable the people uh, to man their own business and that seriously what you, what you are seeing that he was very very happy and hoping that um, which although the one is in the did not talk about anything in Amdekano to the ears of the Mr. President or, uh, as many people would have you know be anticipating that that might come up but nothing of such was mentioned however they hope to get you know a, 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 a feedback or an action done on their request that the uh, president should look into the federal security agencies who have arrested and killed hundreds of um, people, you know, being, being tagged to be indigenous people of Biafra or the ESN network, noting that the ESN network has actually was formed to protect uh, the Igbos since uh, the security agencies of the federal level and the state level were not, uh, you know, uh, they can't achieve that alone. And that the, uh, the primary responsibilities of them as a group is to uh, take the uh, security uh, level of the Indigos as a serious concern. Thanks for listening. Good morning.